I've always been so enamored with elephants. One of the things that's just amazing to me is that elephants have such an incredibly low rate of cancer. And it doesn't make any sense that elephants have a low rate of cancer because they're so big and their cells are dividing so fast. Inside Science. For a long time, it was a mystery how elephants managed to grow so big without getting cancer. Because every time a cell divides, there is a risk that it could mutate into a cancerous form. And it takes a lot of cell divisions for an elephant embryo to grow into a 13,000 pound animal. Their cells are dividing so quickly that just by chance alone, they should just like have really high rates of, of mutation and cancer. But they have a gene. Uh, they have many copies of this gene, as a matter of fact, that causes their cells to commit suicide if they mutate. It could not have evolved to be that large if it did not also evolve to have that gene. Researchers at the University of Utah are now working with human cells to see whether the elephant's cancer-fighting technique could lead to new medical treatments. And again, this is happening in a petri dish, but it's really exciting. You have these uh, cancer cells. They're human cells, but they've been taught essentially to act like elephant cells would. And when a mutation happens uh, that's cancerous, the cells, instead of reproducing, just kill themselves. For a really long time, we figured like the way we we're going to have to fight cancer was one cancer at a time because they're very different. But this process appears to work for every kind of cancer that they've tried it on. This is Inside Science. Inside Science. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on the web and social media. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.